Marquette. And last a little bit of daylight we can see here on the Michigan Tech webcam looking towards downtown Houghton. You can see it right here on the screen. Some faint daylight all in all though quiet weather in the Houghton Hancock area this evening. And other than some wind and cold temperatures, it is going to be on the colder side tonight. Let's go to our local three radar network here. You can see dry conditions and get used to this type of a radar picture here as we go through the next oh even five to seven days. Really nothing widespread is in the the weather forecast. Let's get you to our radar and satellite here and you can see we do have clearing conditions across the upper Great Lakes region back into Wisconsin and also Minnesota. But here is this large storm system, this large slow moving storm system that continues to move up into eastern Canada. Still on the backside of it, we do have some snow across Ohio and eastern Pennsylvania and this is Lake Huron and also Lake Erie helping out on some of this snow. This will continue to lift away from Upper Michigan, but we're still close enough where, like I've been saying, we are going to continue at least to see some wind tonight through the daytime on Wednesday. So here's three things to know here. We are looking at some wind that's going to continue tonight on into the daytime on Wednesday. Not a full blown windy night or full blown windy day for Wednesday, but some wind will still be around cold tonight, but the overall weather pattern does show at or above average temperatures pretty much right through the weekend and even into early next week. We got temperatures temperatures in the 20s and 30s across the UP. High temperatures today were around the 30 degree mark or the 30s. And as we look at our highest wind gusts, they were up there at times. Some areas, especially the central and the eastern UP, gusting into the 25 to 35 mile per hour range. So here's our Upper Michigan weather outlook with future weather conditions. No weather issues tonight. And then for tomorrow, we're looking at a bright, beautiful, sunny day. And then for tomorrow night on into Thursday morning, we're going to have a weak storm system drop on in and this might bring us some snow showers across the eastern UP. Really not much to this. And then as we go into Thursday night on into Friday, another weaker storm system drops on in and that brings us maybe an outside chance of snow. But for those of you looking for some outdoor recreational sports such as snowmobiling, skiing, that type of snow is just not in our weather forecast through at least early next week. Mainly clear skies for tonight with some wind. Low temperatures tonight will be in the coldest Western UP will, where we will see temperatures in the lower teens. Elsewhere, we'll see low temperatures tonight around the 20 degree mark or the 20s. Here's your UP community extended forecast. First for Marquette County, we're looking at temperatures in the 30s for the daytime on Wednesday. And then temperatures for highs remain around the 30 degree mark or the 30s for high temperatures. Outside chance or a slight chance of snow, maybe Thursday a snowflake could fly and then again on Friday and then again on Sunday. For the eastern UP, we'll have temperatures for Wednesday afternoon around 40 and then highs Thursday through Sunday in the 30s. There is a slight chance of snow on Thursday, Friday and once again on Sunday. For Delta County and Escanaba, temperatures will be around 40 for Wednesday, 30s for the daytime on Thursday and also Friday. And then we're back to around 40 for the daytime on Saturday. But little or no precipitation is in the weather forecast for Delta County and also areas along the Michigan-Wisconsin border. Little or no precipitation in the weather forecast. Highs around 40 for Wednesday, 30s for Thursday, and then roughly 30s to around 40 for Friday and Saturday, maybe a touch chillier on Sunday. Finally, the Keweenaw Peninsula, we're looking at temperatures in the 30s for Wednesday, and then temperatures for highs roughly in the 30s, still at or above average for this time of year with little or no snow in the weather forecast. Weather anytime on our webpage, upmatters.com, and on our Facebook page. Becca, back to you.